More than 60 university students about to join the TA have been put through their paces in Germany as part of a pre-commissioning course. Under Army 2020, the government aims to increase the number of reservists to 30,000 in the next few years. And University Officer Training Corps will become a key recruiting ground. Ali Gibson has been to meet the students on their final exercise in Senelaga. <laughs> The four-week-long exercise summer leader run by Northumbrian UOTC is designed to teach these students how to stick to their skills and drills in difficult conditions. In the final part of this exercise, these officer cadets must retake a village that's been seized by enemy forces. Every movement and decision that they make is analysed and is designed to prepare them for the TA commissioning course at Sandhurst. Under the Army 2020 plans recently announced, the role of university officer training corps and recruiting for the reserves is to become more important. We've got young people who have got plenty of time to spend seven weeks in the summer doing the sort of demanding training that we're putting them through. That's much more challenging for folks who have jobs in civilian life as well. So we're using that opportunity, maximising it, and hopefully we will be the bulk of the TA commissioning course intake this year. Instructors from Sandhurst are also observing the exercise this year so that recruits who go on to the TA commissioning course can hit the ground running. Myself and the colour sergeant think that looking at them you could be looking at an intake of regular commissioning course in the junior term. There's a nice spectrum of people uh, from all backgrounds, from very good to the not so good uh, and a, a sort of whole bunch in between. And they're all you know, what unites them all is their uh, enthusiasm, the drive, determination. Uh, you know, despite being day five of a quite a tough exercise, they're still giving their all. For these potential reservists, getting time in the field ahead of Sandhurst has been invaluable. We were going from building to building and um, basically chucking a grenade in, waiting for it to go off, going in, clearing the room, making sure the room was secure and then carrying on, just basically making sure there were no enemy in any of the buildings. And how was it? How was the whole experience? Really good fun, quite confusing because um, obviously everyone's shouting and firing and the smoke and different rooms and buildings and all the different sections are kind of intermingling. Exercise Summer Leader has also expanded this year to take on 10 American University reservists who won't be going to Sandhurst but have still picked up certain things from their British colleagues. A hot brew in a cold field is absolutely delicious and boosts morale tremendously. <laughs> um, they've also taught us some great uh, tactics and then also just the basics of how their military breaks down at the platoon and company levels. It's hoped that next year the Americans may be able to return the favour and host British students in the US. Ali Gibson, Forces News, Senalaga.